What's up people, Cypher here. Welcome back to Sector 2 Lost Crusade. And I'm going to claim. And I'm going to log in. And I'm going to get to today. What are we doing? It's the BTS. You're on troop training on that one, isn't it? Oh look, personal armory and architect. Defeat chaos, defeat hostiles. Alliance tech contribution. Ah, okay. Pretty simple. Do your scan. And I'll do the hostiles closer to the end of the date. You know, I'll sort of hit hostiles as I do. But yeah, let's get to the day, innit? Oh, look, salvage wreckage as well. Oh, my word. I'm going to have to go find a blue square. What else is there? Oh, the bonus benefits as well. Rogue Trader, use your free blade knight. How many? 140. Oh my word. Actually, I got a trick for that. I'll do that in a bit. So as I've explained before in a previous mission, we had the free blade knight there and to use it, you had to use it a lot of times. It might have even been the very same event that just when it rolled over last time. But I was sort of told something which I was like, ah, that ain't going to work, is it? And then it did work. So send your garrison out and send your free blade knight out with it. Right now, because of the update, my knights are being sent automatically. So it's a lot easier to do so. You just send an auto deployment. The mark of the heretic. Send an auto deployment. If you bear the honor and glories of the past, you must also bear its duties. And then recall. This way you're not spending AP, you're not having to wait for them to mine down a node or anything like that. So recall. And I just got to do that plenty more times. <laughs> 140 times. Got to do that and then, you know, at least you've cleared it. And that should be a lot more efficient than any other way, to be honest. While it lasts. I don't even know if it's supposed to do that, right? And there's a small chance that... <laughs> by me putting a light to this or at least suggesting it as a tip <laughs> it might then get eradicated or taken out so be wary that might be the case however right now you can use your free blade knight just to garrison one of your allies bases and funnily enough you will gain rewards for it or at least it'll progress you through this sector exploration and it so that's what i'm going to do in a bit though what else was there today so that's the bonus benefits. And I cleared the Rogue Trader. That's done. And I'm just working my way through the Titan now. So I just got to sit there indefinitely and send him out. Actually, Void Wells are about right now, as we've seen right there. This is going to be a Void Well. So, I'm going to automatically the send of faith is one the mark of them out. The heretic. I shouldn't have automatically sent that. I should have sent that as a deployment. Ha! <laughs> Never mind. Either way, it's a part of a rally. <laughs> <laughs> right, where was I again? I was back in the event screen, isn't it? Let's see what else is going on. Breach the Storm is going through troop training right now. So when it clocks over, it will be command day, it will be kill day. I'll see if I can catch any bases burning. Last time I wasn't that lucky. There's a load of bases out there that are like being called to be hit. But they're giganto, like they've paid a lot, obviously, because they've got a huge base. Therefore, you don't see, you really end up seeing these ones set on fire. So it's not really worth watching, <laughs> to be honest. But I will keep an eye out, and if I see anything, I'll try and catch it. Out. The Rogue Trader, I'm flying through this because I cleared the previous Rogue Trader. So that's cool. Now, before I go on to that, I'm going to chuck another. If you bear the honor and glory, because the past, then that's another free blade knight sent out in it while I'm doing this. It only makes sense. The signal event is still a day away, and I've pretty much flew through all but one. So that's good. Progressing nicely on that one. On the Archeotech, wow, got a few to collect. So the Alliance Tech contribution, flying through that nicely. Going nicely through the Chaos one, I believe, as well. Well, I'm, I'm casually going through the Chaos one, but then, then again, we still do have a few days left, and one of these other days are going to contain a mission of the Augur Array, which is the scan. So they kind of mount up together. And then hostile fleets. I ain't touched them yet. I'll do them in the future though. As I said, day five will probably be the day I sort of unload on all these bad boys. I got a hundred to hit. Fun. Now, claim online rewards. Seems like I've done all those. 
What about Cordis trial? Yeah, that one's done. And that was nice. Okay, so cool. We are working our way nicely through this one. And I'm almost there to getting another legendary tech frag. For real. I think I've done my... Yeah, done challenge mode. And personal armory. What is it on right now? Trained soldiers. So nothing special. Even though trained soldiers is the BTS right now. So it's probably wise for me to actually do some training. Just to at least clear some missions here. And it it'll proceed a bit better on the Breeze of Storm rankings. Because I'm not exactly uber high <laughs> i'm still in the top 100 though ish you know on a variable and what else are we looking at in terms of things ah the bonus benefits i don't know what we'll have to see on the next one when it clocks over see what they what the new day is saying but what is tomorrow saying it's literally nothing added other than what we're doing anyway whoa that was crazy other than black rock cool so Chaos Attack will be there as well, but that'll be done on Sunday more so than Saturday. So really, it's a case of just now sending me deployments out to garrison bases indefinitely for a while just to get this Titan mission done. Yes. Thank you very much for watching the video. Please remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and comment if you like to. Much appreciated if you do. Bless up.